All right, this episode, episode two of Bungo Stray Dogs is called A Certain Bomb, and that does not bode well with me. It gets me a little nervous for this episode. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Bungo Stray Dogs Season 1, Episode 2. Uh, last episode, we had the introduction to our armed detective agency or private investigators who have supernatural powers who investigate the supernatural and stuff beyond the capabilities of our military and police cannot wait to uh, i did not end up going back and writing out all their names i'm going to do that after this episode um, i'm sure i'll meet some more of them and then get them again but i definitely want to get all their names right now all i have is kunikita um atsushi sorry if you guys heard that and Dazai, who i can't wait to learn more about all of them see more of their powers see some action see a whole bunch of stuff i'm ready to dive into this world and dive into this episode i say we don't waste any more time let's do it Remember, though, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all of the shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are in the description for you guys. If you guys want to support me and Patreon's not really your thing, if you guys could just leave me a like and a nice comment down below, it really does help me with that YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys currently are not subscribed. Click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post over here on the Dapper channel. And then follow me on all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, Twitter and TikTok now at Dapper Darius. And don't forget, we do have a PO box. If you guys ever want to send me anything like art, fan mail, anything, anything and everything is much appreciated. All the info for everything is in the description. Like always, let's hop into this. Bungo Stray Dogs, season one, episode two, a certain bomb. Let's do it. Are we going to start every episode with something he reminisces about from his childhood before he was kicked out of the orphanage? It was tea on rice last episode, now it's tatami mats. <laughs> He's got a phone now. Ooh, got a little setup, okay. Good morning! Good morning! Yeah, if he's saying, if Dazai is saying it's an emergency, he's just joking around. He only ever is a trickster like that, you know? I like his outfit. It looks... Yeah, that would actually be horrible. I would actually suffer. Yeah, and you really wouldn't be able to get down on your own. Oh, just even seeing that, get the fucking claustrophobic. Well, all you do is talk about how you want to commit suicide. <laughs> I mean... いや、やっぱり皆さん、with the title card cutting right there, I don't I don't think I'm gonna like this job. Yeah, what is the job? Let's get some detail. Oh, okay. It's not gonna be a good time. Oh, Kunikita. Bandage squandering machine. I like his bandages around his arms, though. His design is so cool. Hmm. Sounds like a. Sounds like Desai. Some weirdos got. Yep. Mm. Also sounds like Desai. In the same month. That impression was spot on. <laughs> Yeah, no. 
一分の無駄にしてしまった爆弾魔が人質を取って探偵者に立てこもった<笑>爆弾魔 What? That is quite the emergency Maybe this will be the test. Maybe this is the test that he needs to pass. I sure hope so. I hope no one actually gets injured. He's like, why don't we just do what he says? Business trip. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors to see who deals with it. Ja Junkin! Ooh, what is his ability? Mmm. I wanna see it. So the only one he wouldn't know is Asushi, which I still think this is the test. But if it's not, I also think Atsushi would be the best candidate for this. <laughs> Since I haven't even said anything. This criminal was making Kunikita throw it back. <laughs> he looks like a newspaper delivery boy. <laughs> That is true. He's like, at the end of the day, I want to be able to live. So that's not reason to live for. Come on. <laughs> Meanwhile, you just got Kunikita's ass just sticking in the air over here. <laughs> It's funny, I can hear Thorfinn's voice sometimes when he talks. He's a good range. <laughs> well, he is somewhat of a worthless life form, you know? Ability. Dopo Poet. That's his last name, Dopo, right? Kunikita Dopo. Wire Gun. Can he create anything he writes down? So I guess this wasn't a test. I guess this was serious. I was thinking this was going to be the test the whole time. He's going to be like, wow, really? And then he's going to be like, just kidding again. I'm just messing with you. And then his pen's going to snap. <laughs> Thirty seconds. He actually started it. Mitigate the force of the explosion. If we can find something to cover the bomb. Who throws her? Oh my God! My man is willing to actually lay on a grenade. That's a real fucking one. This is definitely the test. I'm glad this is the test, and it's revealed to be the test. But. It's like Captain America. My boy Atsushi is a real fucking one. He's a he's a gangster for that. Willing to literally lay your life on the line to protect other people. Anizaki. Oh, so the part-time Naomi was actually her little brother. But you asked if we could read and write. What does that have to do with defusing a bomb? <laughs> Fucking Gintama? Gintoki walking in? What the hell? 
Hold on, I had him test your metal, obviously. This is the president of the ADA, um, Fukuzawa Yakuchi, Yakichi. All men are created equal, all men must die, all are ghoulis? Relax. Interesting. See, I'm telling you, Desai is so much deeper than he lets off. Okay. Thank you, Desai, for the recommendation. Now we are members of the ADA. <laughs> First day, his interview is using his body to shield a bomb. Don't just lay it out like that, Desai. Come on. He already has it. You're a wanted tiger. Oh, that's so funny. At best, you'd get fired. At worst, you'd be murdered. Obviously, you're a tiger. He's still holding the fucking bomb. Okay, that was quite the ending to episode two. <laughs> After credit scene? I didn't know these were in this show. Oh, this is the guy from the opening and ending. The were tiger? It's like a werewolf, but a were tiger? That's crazy. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm excited. So, I do like the concept of this test, like especially, this has been done in multiple other shows where there's uh, a character who's questionably joining this agency because some people don't really accept him, some do, so there needs to be some sort of test where the character has no idea of what's going on to prove whether they're valid enough to join said agency. And exactly like Captain America, no hesitation, I mean, he was, he was trying to think around for a second, I don't blame him obviously, but willing to lay his life down on the line for other people and everyone was impressed and thoroughly pleased with the results and it was a good test you know uh, dealing with how he would talk in certain high pressure scenarios and how he would deal with certain <laughs> i don't know a hostage situation a whole bunch of things this was a this was a good test i i'm really interested to know more about the president i i honestly and this is just about a lot of animes i can't wait to learn literally so many characters backstories and stuff like that because the backstories are so well done and i can tell these characters are established characters who have very distinct personalities and have been that way because of certain events in their life so i cannot wait to see that i cannot wait to see this enemy we saw at the end there with the red power whatever oh they said the were tiger cannot wait to see more powers dopeness everything i want to see more of kunikita's power he said dopo poet wire gun so is it kind of like basho from hunter hunter where any he was a high q expert where if he would write it in a high q form it would come true i'm pretty sure it had to be a high q right I'm like this chair is on fire i am i don't know you know what i'm trying to say but like he did that and he lit a chair on fire one time to test i remember that i just ah i really like it i really like the concept i, I love powers i want to dig deeper i got to i'm gonna watch this next episode probably i gotta i gotta eat some lunch do a little bit of, do a little bit of editing you guys know how it goes but if you guys enjoyed please leave a like let me know your thoughts down below i'm very excited i will catch you guys later peace out dapper squad have a great day peace out